It is a fairy tale union which is captivating Sweden. Crown Princess Victoria, heir to the Swedish throne, is marrying her fitness trainer boyfriend, Daniel Westling. The pair met when she worked out in the gym he owned in Stockholm, but it wasn't love at first sight. We were very good friends before and it was a friendship that grew and became love. And that is a great safety to have, to stand on as a foundation. The Royal Album already offers a snapshot of the ceremonial role Mr. Westling will play in Swedish life. Once he's married, he'll swap his dumbbells for the title, Prince Daniel, Duke of Västergötland. The Royal Palace, Princess Victoria's family seat, does of course strike a grand contrast to this, the house where her fiancé grew up. His hometown of Kelbo has a population of just 6,000, but this working class community is dead proud of its now most famous son. When you think about it, we're about to become part of history. Daniel is from here, he was raised here, and now he will become Sweden's prince. That of course feels very flattering and really cool in every way. In Stockholm, the wedding is dominating the skyline, but it's also triggered a debate about why an egalitarian country like Sweden still maintains a royal family. But there is, though, still widespread support for the young couple. She's been waiting so long, and, and we think it's a good, I think it's a good thing. I think it's wonderful uh, that she, because they have lived together for seven years. But it wouldn't, of course, be a proper fairy tale without a sweet ending. Confectioners are already cashing in on how a princess and a commoner lived happily ever after. Alex Rossi, Sky News.